Hello everyone, this is Lucas from Enterprise Repair and Automation Edmonton coming at you with part 7 of uh, 2013 Hyundai Accent clutch replacement video. And I just got my flashlight on here. So, as you can see now, we have the car up on jack stands and I got rid of the corner here where the metal is all folded. I don't know if you can see that. I'm trying to get this down here. You can see the metal is mostly folded double quadruple over in that one spot. That's where I got it up on the jack stands here. That's where I had it up last time when I was attempting to do this repair but couldn't get the bell housing down. And I've got the tires off as you can see. And I've also shot a whole bunch of WD-40 in here along the spline bolts and a whole bunch of other stuff because um, we got to take a lot of the suspension um, components and everything out of the way in order to access the uh, ball joints to be able to pull them free of the bearing and uh, to be able to uh, pull them free of the uh, transfer case uh, way, way back in there. I don't know if you can see that. Way back in there. Right back in there is your transfer case. So I'm going to let that WD-40 sink in for a day. I'm also going to shoot uh, the bearing nuts. I forgot to do that. The uh, main bearing nuts. I always usually shoot those really good. It's a good idea because... Uh, they're usually pretty tough to get off and uh, in order to get them off you actually have to uh, use a punch and spread out the uh, the nut again in order for it to move. But I'll get to that in the next video. Uh, so yeah, I got the tire back tires blocked off there on the one direction here only so far. And I got the uh, both spare tires tucked underneath the car here as you can see so the car can't fall down. Um, at present can't fall down on the front it's just gonna fall on the tires if it falls and uh, I'm gonna have everything blocked up here for the night I'm gonna let that WD-40 sink in and uh, I'm gonna spray like I said I'm gonna spray those um, uh, main bearing nuts as well um, before I uh, top them out with the uh, punch and uh, sockets so I'll be back with uh, part 8 and uh, show you how I'm gonna do all that kind of stuff and uh, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe and uh, keep watching for more.